I am with Jason Falls, Mr. No Bullshit Social Media Marketing. I love saying that. I have so much fun saying that. It's a good title, isn't it? It is a great title. So we're here on the closing day of Blog World in LA. We've been talking to a lot of bloggers this weekend, asking them this question. When you first started blogging, okay. what was that fear that originally surfaced for you that you had to work through so you could do what you do now? Wow, that's a really good question. I think the, the biggest thing for me was because I was a, when I started blogging at Social Media Explorer, I was a public relations account manager at an ad agency and I didn't I worked with a couple of big brands but I didn't have a sort of a national, you know, footprint. I didn't have this I wasn't a thought leader. I didn't think of myself as one at the time. And so the fear for me was is what I'm saying are my opinions valid? Can I get that validation from you know, the, the, the thought leaders of the world at the time? So the Shell Israels and the Chris Brogans and whatnot back then. And I was always sort of wondering, uh, I, you know, I, and Amber Naslin calls it the imposter syndrome. You kind of feel like you don't really belong. Um, and so I always had that fear that my opinions are going to be laughed at because they're not well thought, thought out or something. And so what I learned, though, is over time, um, you learn to sort of vet your own ideas and that fear actually helps you polish them so that you don't have to worry about it anymore and you gain that confidence by experience. Mm, wise words. <laughs>